Hello and welcome back to the January gas leak. This is bonus puzzle number three. It's called Zipper Line Sudoku by Philip Newman. Normal Sudoku rules apply. Zipper, for each line, the digits in each pair of cells an equal distance away from the central cell of the line to the digit in the central cell of the line. All right, so what does that actually mean? Well, Philip gives an example and we'll color code as we go along. Row 3, column 3, right, is this digit here. It is the central cell of this 5 length zipper line. If we go an equal distance away, so one step in this direction and one step in this direction from the central cell of the line, we look at those two digits, that is row 2, column 2, and row 4, column 2, these two digits, when summed together, will equal 9. So this would be, you know, 1, 8, 2, 7, 3, 6, 4, 5. You know, in some order. I guess it can't be 3, 6, but there you go. Then here, these two cells, which are now 1, 2, 1, 2, steps away from the central cell, must also sum to 9. So I think we, uh, we, we know how to move on from there. And that applies for all of the zipper lines throughout the puzzle here. All right, those are the rules. Let's just jump right into it. So, <laughs> pretty much, 6 gives us 3 there. Um, 8, 7 gives us 1. 4 gives us 4. 5 gives us 2. From there... All right, how do we make how do we make six in two digits? Normally, there are two ways. Technically, for a zipper, right, as we see here, there are more ways because we could do double three, but double three can't exist in here. And this, I was, I was wow, okay. I was going to say this can't be two, four, which means it has to be one, five, but better yet, four just sees both of these cells by Sudoku, not even looking at just this. So this must be one, five. Then, I don't know what to do from there. Um, hmm. I guess, what, what digits are we missing from here? We are missing 1, 2, 3, 6, and 9. Ah, okay. I'm going to remove 9, because 9, 9 has a little thing. It can't go on the zipper line if it's not in the central cell, because how would 9, for example, plus something else, be a digit less than 9, right? Because the maximum you could put on the central line is, in fact, 9. So 9 just goes in the center here. 1, 5, <clears throat> excuse me, says that this can't be 1. That means 1 either goes here or here. If it's 1, then it's 6 here. Uh, that's not a really good way to do it. 6. And if it's 1, it's 7. Four, seven. All right. <clears throat> of course, symmetry. I should have looked here. How do we make seven? Seven is either going to be one six, which can't be, um, two five, which it can be, or three four, which it can't be. So this is two five, I guess, as opposed to the one five here, which means these can't be two. Does two break here? Two would give us six. Ah, which means. Oh no, never mind. I was going to say no matter what, there's a 6 here, but that's not actually true. Because this this could be 2, 1 here. Which means that this doesn't have to be 6. Alright, never mind. Uh, anyways, what was I saying? And if this is 2, then this is 4, which doesn't actually do anything. So, so what are my options here? Ah, look, 2, 5 tells us that this is 3, this is 2, because we're missing 2 and 3 from there. So 
five. We have to just consider all the options. So one second, let's delete that and let's just go through the whole thing. Oh, sorry. How could this be six? This this couldn't be six. Six can't sit on this own line on its own line. So two would require four. Uh, three would require three. Six two. It can't be two, which means this can't be six. So. 6, 2, 3, 5. Oh, it can't be 5. Okay, so then this is the 1. This is 7. It means this isn't 1. Missing what? 3, 5. Oh, no, we have 5. <laughs> I literally just said that. 3, 8, 9. That's what we're missing. 3, 8, 9. Where well, this can't be 8. And then... Three, six, eight, nine. I guess this is six, eight, nine. Not really seeing a way to restrict that. All right. This digit here. Oh, sorry. Of course. If this is three, then this is four. That's allowed. If that's six, then it's one. I guess this can't be six anymore. Sorry, of course, because I removed one as an option. Then six, eight, nine, and two. Two. Two could work with six. So one second. Two is six, so that's still valid. Two is six. Three is five. And well, it can't be five. Uh, so this can't be three. And six is two. So actually we have a two six pair, which means this is three, which means this is three. Which means that oh, this is six. This is two. Two means this is six. Six means this is one. 6 means that's no longer 6, it's 8, 9. 9, 3, 9, 3, 8, 9, 3. Can't go here any longer. 9 and 4. So we got 4, 8, 9, where this must be 4 because of the 8, 9 pair. This is 8, 9. 8, 9. Oh, same logic, right? Where does 9 go? Can't go on the zipper line, so 9 must go here. 9 then must go here, I think, by Sudoku, which gives us 8, 8, 9, 9, 8. 8 is similarly restricted. If this can't be 9, then how could this be 8? So this must be 8 which means this must be 8 by Sudoku. This can't be 8. This must be 8. That gives us 8 here. And actually, is that all the 8s? That is. Can we not do all the 9s yet? Seriously? 9, nine should be more restrictive than the 8s, but I actually can't do anything with them. I don't see it. All right. What are we missing across the row here? One, two, three. This can't be two. This can't be three. Two, three. What can this be? Can't be nine, eight, seven, six. So this is either. It definitely can be five. It can be four. It can't be three or two. Um, so. Or five. If this was five, this could oh this couldn't be four. So if this was five, this couldn't be four. So what, what we're missing across here is what? We're missing one. Oh two. We're missing two. Two just goes here. We're missing one, four, and five. Five means this is one or four. Four would mean that this is three. One would mean that this is six. Oh, it can't be three. Sorry. This is 6. This is 1. 1 leaves us with a 4-5 pair. Oh, and and if... Yeah. If it's, if it's 5, this would have to be 3. It can't be 3. Same thing we just eliminated from there, which means this must be 2, which means this must be 4, which means... Yes. Which means this is a 1-3 pair. Two, eight, nine. 
Still can't do 9, but we can do 5 here. 2 gives us a 1, 3 pair, which means this is 2. 2. All right, can't, can't do that yet by Sudoku. What are we missing across here? We are missing 4 and 7. 7 gives us 4 here, 7 here. And one three, one three seven nine, three seven nine. Uh, this can't be one. We know it can't be nine already. This can't be three or seven. This could be any of the options. Four, hmm. four. Uh, maybe that's what we need to think about here. How do we make nine in two digits? We can't do one eight. We can't do 2, 7. We can't do 3, 6. So it must be 4, 5. 4, 5 does leave us with 7 here. 2, 5, and 6. 6. This must be 2 because it can't be 5, which means this is 5. This is 2. 2 with something equals this. This could still be 9. One, three, five, nine, and six. Once again, six is missing. This is six. One, three leaves us with what? Seven, eight. We know, oh no, not seven, eight. Sorry. Whew. Definitely seven goes here though. Seven, five. Five gives us one, gives us five. One gives us three, gives us one. Three gives us nine, gives us three. That leaves us with one, two, four, eight, nine. Yep, 9 here. 9 here does place 9 here. 9 here, which means this is 2, 7, which means this is 3, which means this. Oh, wait. Uh-oh. 3, 6. Sorry, let's go back. This is definitely 3, 3, 5, and 9. This is definitely 9. 9 can't go here, it must go here. 9, 2, 2 gives us 7. 7. Yeah, we're missing what? 3 and what? Why am I blanking? 3 and 4. It's the only place 4 can go. So this must be 4, this must be 3, which means this must be 6. So. What is going on here? Let's go back. I don't know how far I need to go back. All right, this definitely places six here, which definitely does five, seven, which gives us one, which gives us three, which gives us three, which makes this nine. Because right now, 9 can only go in these spaces here. Right now, if this is 9, that makes this 2. So this can't be 9, essentially, which would mean, what digit could it be? Can't be 4. Can't be 5, 6, can't be 7 or 8. It has to be 9. But that breaks everything, which means probably we made a mistake further back. Let's just remove all of those as an option. So, Did I mess up here with the 4, 5? No, because if this has to be 2, which it does by Sudoku, then this would have to be 4. Only way I know to make 4 is 1, 3. The 
means if we're looking at sixes by Sudoku, six must go here, which would leave us with the five, seven. That gives us the one, that gives us the three, that gives us the three. Three, one, three, nine. This is five. Nine by Sudoku would go here. So maybe from here, if we look at this again, maybe there's something that we've missed. Four, seven definitely places four here, seven here. So what pair is this that adds up to nine? Can't be one, eight. It can be two, seven. It can't be three, six. It can't be four, five. So it must be two, seven. If this must be two, seven, then what is the remainder here? The remainder here is 3 and something, 3 and 4, and once again, this is 4, this is 3, 3 with 9 makes this 6, and we've broken something. Hmm. Which means something even further back is a problem. Two definitely has to go there, Sudoku-wise, based on the digits that we've placed. Whoops. Can't be 5. If it's 4, then it breaks with 3, which means it does have to be 1, 6. Hmm. Why did I say that had to be 9? That's the issue. Why does this have to be 9? Why can't that be 9? Alright, so now let's see if that does any better for us. This is 9, this is 8. 8 makes this 9, 8. 8 means this is 3, 9. Hopefully that was it. Again, if we look across here, we're still missing 2, this is 2, 1, 4, 5, if this is 4, 3, so we can use some of the work that we've done before that we know is correct, at least that we think we know is correct, this is 5, this is 1, this is 6, I feel comfortable with that. Now where does 6 go? 6 has to go here, 6 again leaves us with the 5, 7, but this time this 9 isn't here, so maybe that's the difference, 1, 5, 1 gives us 3, 1, 3 gives us 3, 9, this must be 9. So now, where does 9 go in this box? Can't go here, can't go here, can't go here, or here, it must go here. This can't be 1, 2, 7, 3, 6, so it must be 2, 7. If this is 2, 7, then our remaining digits are what? We're missing 3, four and yeah because th this is the problem is the four here kept forcing four here which made this three we know that this can't be three which means it is either four or whatever the other digit is four or eight if it's eight then it's one it doesn't work so that means this is four this is five so now we might be able to do this uh three eight ah, and we know the order of course three eight eight what are missing here we're missing 4 and 6. 4, 6. What are we missing here? 2 and 2 and 4. 4 gives us 5. 5.
one, four, six. Ah, this is just six by Sudoku. One, four, six gives us four, six. This is a one, four pair, which we know the order for. This is one, this is four. Just because of the four we've now gotten. And now, two, five, seven. This must be seven. That means this is five, this is two, this is two, this is seven. The triple, or actually even better, we're just missing eight from the column. We're missing five and six. We know the order. This is five, this is six. Five gives us seven, five. Yeah, I think that was the issue. Me placing nine there when nine did not belong there. Not in the slightest. Anyways, three... Uh, 378. It's a chocolate teapot. 378. This can't be 8. This can't be 7. This can't be 3. I'm sure we'll have the resolution soon enough. 1, 2 actually gives us a 1, 2 pair. Oh, 2. Double 2 is what we're looking for. This is 1 and this is 9. Aha. And that place is 9 there. Theoretically, we knew that 9 didn't work there, but we wanted to prove that a little bit more logically <laughs> than just we tried to place it there and it was wrong. 1, 3, 8 places 1 here. This is 3 or 8, which means it must be 3. This must be 8. 8 means this is 7. This is 3. This is 7. And then to finish us off, we still need to place 4. We need to place 8. And we are done. 20 minutes and 13 seconds with Zipper Line Sudoku by Philip Newman. We definitely could have cut off like probably at least five to seven minutes by not placing nine there, just realizing that nine went somewhere there because nine was always placed here, but it was the nine here that put the four here where the nine belonged, which broke everything. But yeah, anyways, that was bonus puzzle number three. I will see you for bonus puzzle four. So I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching.